What's up, my bros? My name is SuperFastGamer37, and have a story you want to tell. You always got to be proactive. But, before I tell the story, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Let's get started. You always got to be proactive. Got to always make good choices. But don't be reactive. Reactive means like doing b making bad choices, bullying someone. It's not good. And picking your nose at school is not okay too. It's not. It's gross. Or something like that. If you burp or fart, say excuse me. Or I would say toot because it's the same thing. But um, the thing is though. I, if you are a leader up at the high school, follow the students who look up to you, and let's say, man, what a great guy he is, he's a great jokester, he's a special kind of guy, he's my kind of guy. You know, when you start being proactive, and making good choices is really means so much to me. It's really awesome that I make very good choices. And for me, I make good choices. Also, I need to I need, need to listen to your parents. Do as they say, and if they say do chores, do chores. Don't argue. Just do chores. And if you've been bad, been a bad boy, you get your privileges taken away. Your parents are the parents. You're the child. You're the child. But your dad's a king. And your mom's a queen. Don't say you're the king. You're the child. If you're the child of the house, you gotta listen to your parents, what they say. And uh, say, do something, what if they say, do your chores. Say yes, dad, or yes, mom. And say, say that. And, yeah. It's really important to your parents. Mm. It's really important. Just wanna uh also I wanna give a shout out to Julie Tyus because she's a, a great teacher and she's the greatest bestest teacher ever and gonna always be a good boy. Sometimes so special sometimes you're special. Sometimes but you're special, and the thing is, uh, the thing is, gotta listen to your parents, and you're special, and it's like, it's like, I don't know what to say, it's, it's amazing. Well, it's a long story. Since when I was born on June 4th, or something like that, since when I was born, I never cried since it came out of my uh, mom's belly. Never cried because I weighed like uh, 10 pounds or something. I don't want to give my information away so that I don't want to get hacked. So, I'm not going to tell any more of that. But, uh, and then I'm 15 now. And this year, I'm going to be 16. So, my name is SuperFastGum37. And if you enjoyed this story, hit that like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't. Already, hit that bell to get notifications, to get notified, and I will see you all later. Bye-bye, everyone.